Like most healthcare systems, CHI St. Alexius in Williston wants to stay on top of their game to best serve the community, and by doing so, they've purchased some new equipment. KX News' Malik Wilson set, got an inside look and learned about the many benefits behind it. St. Alexis in Williston is the first hospital in the state and the only one in our region that this new Just two weeks ago, CHI St. Alexius Williston Medical Center purchased five new Stryker 1688 towers equipped with true native 4K surgical video capabilities. The new Stryker towers utilize both fluorescence and laser technology um, to help determine um, best approach for each individual patient. Here's how it works. Our anesthesia provider injecting a dye into the patient's IV Okay, before the case, that dye attaches itself to blood, and when we activate the laser, the the um, the dye excites the blood and it illuminates. Mayo told me this now allows doctors to pinpoint exact problems in areas like knees, shoulders, and even the gallbladder, which is a common problem for most patients. The technology could also lead to shorter and safer surgeries for both the patient and surgeon, with key features like pneumoclear. A smoke evacuator, so that it kicks on automatically as you're doing, as you're bowing, um, cauterizing um, during your procedure, takes the smoke particles out of the abdomen and puts it through a filtration system the machine so that that smoke or plume never goes out into the air. This equipment did have a hefty price tag of nearly a million dollars, but by the help of generous donations to the CHI Foundation, the cost was covered. It's just, it's awesome when we can finally um, gather enough support to, to purchase um, something that we really, really need. So. Reporting for KX News in Williston, Malik Wilson. I love that picture at the end there. Mayo says so far only four cases have been used with these new machines. The